guys and welcome back to Mad Resales. I'm Natalie. I'm Will. And we are resellers, meaning we flip bottoms all in for profit. In today's video, we're going to take you on a journey going to some Goodwills, hopefully buy things cheap, sell it high online for a profit. Goodwill. The goodest of the will. <laughs> this brand doesn't need an introduction. Patty for your daddy. Let's go. There is some wear on here. I'll go over with the pilling machine, see what I can do. Is still a pickup for sure. In great condition, these are $50. Let's go. <laughs> good, good find here. As you can see, there was major pilling on this vest. So I just went over with the fabric shaver. It's a very simple process and definitely a tool you want to keep around as a reseller, but also as a non-reseller. And look at the results. It looks brand new. Boom. Also picked up a pair of bread and butter Adidas track pants. As long as they're in great condition, automatic pickup here. It's a size medium, mesh lined, Climate 365, easy 25 plus shipping here. Then this one, it's a vintage Toltex. Toltex t-shirt and it says grab a big butt <laughs> <laughs> is there anything on the back yes and on the back i want that big butt i want big that. butt cigar, cigar. <laughs> I, need that, <laughs> I knew he would like that one <laughs> as i was going through the women's section i just felt this thicker, higher quality material, and I looked at the tag, I thought it was going to be Russell Athletic, but of course the actual tag was ripped off so I couldn't see the brand, but it didn't seem like a Russell Athletic tag. So at this point I was kind of considering getting it for myself, but then I noticed this little tab right here. Do you notice the logo? These are called Discus Athletic. It is a great vintage brand to be on the lookout for and they sell very well. And this one already sold on Poshmark after two days. And then I found this really dope vintage t-shirt and I wanted to go over a few indicators that a shirt is vintage. Single stitching is one good indicator and on the tag itself it can also say made in USA or Mexico. Those can be really good indicators as well, although not guaranteed of course. But the best indicator is if the shirt actually has the year it was made on it. That makes life so much easier. This was a really cool find. It was a brand new with tags jersey by Apex One of the Homestead Grace, which was a professional baseball team that played in the Negro Leagues in the United States. It had the uh, Negro Leagues Baseball Museum patch on the sleeve. Just a super dope black and gray jersey with the all stitched back. Look at that Grace spell out. And after looking up comps, I should get a pretty penny for this one. So I see this leather coat here, Jose Bank Signature Collection. Let's see if it's real leather, 100% genuine leather. Let's go. Feels super soft. I think we could at least get about 40 bucks for it without looking up comps. Nice. George, no. Just a plain polo, no. I don't know what these are. George, nope. Cropped and barrel. No. Oh, 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 almost got me. Almost got me. We got a vintage tag Nike mock neck long sleeve shirt. Easy, easy pickup here. We've sold many of these before. Should be an easy 25, 30 plus shipping. So I felt the amazing quality of the shirt. It is a Vineyard Vines Performance, 5% spandex here. Seltzer rate over 100%, should get about 20 to 25 plus shipping. Hey Will. We are the Goodwill Hunters. We have Natalie here. Sounded like an ad. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna find some good stuff today. Nike Zooms. Garamaxes tend to sell well. These are different. 
Alrighty, we got a vintage Lee Sport Red Sox sweatshirt. Got the stitch front, embroidered little logo right here. Seems to be in good condition, big size. Very, very, very nice. We're always on the lookout for bread and butter sports sweatshirts and hoodies. I just saw the sleeve on this one. Beautiful sweater, new brand for me. It's called Antartex. No idea how you say that. Size large, the warmest place on earth, made in Great Britain. Beautiful all over pattern here. And I looked up the comps, very good sell through it right now. And the ones with a lot of pattern going on, not just the plain one color ones, are selling better than the plain ones. Should get 30 to $40 for it. So nice, nice flip here. It's $4.89 at Goodwill. Um, at the edge of the women's rack, I was just at. There's a brand new with tags Vineyard Vines, a quarter zip sweater, color marshmallow white. I love it. Very, very low key, nice find of the day. So I see a Harley tag. Let's check it out. Looks like it is a cutoff sweet little bear there hopefully there's something on the back hillbilly harley davidson tennessee that's pretty sweet right here we got some under armor performance chino taper leg pants reason i know all that is because under armor has a little style code right here on the tab searched it up by that should get about 25 plus shipping on this found this polar Lauren Italian yarn sweater. Nothing crazy, no crazy money here, but 25 plus shipping, I'm confident we can get for it. All right, guys, that sums up today's thrifting video. Thank you guys so much for watching and thank you for 2,000 subs. 2 <laughs> We finally made it because of you guys. So I really appreciate each and every one of you. Remember again to continue to be rad. Hit like and subscribe if you haven't already. And we'll see you guys in the next video.